Hi everyone, welcome back to Fern Bus. Here we are with a beautiful, beautiful livery. Touches the little cockles of my heart. Look at this. This is the Welsh rugby heart of a nation. Look at this, the Edwards coach. Those of you who don't know anything about rugby union, uh, this is the bus that my beloved Welsh team get taken to the stadium uh, and around the various places. Yes, with the beautiful Welsh dragon. We got the Prince of Wales feathers with the the Welsh Rugby Union, w WRU there. This and this is a wonderful livery, Team Wales. Look at that, Camu Edwards. It's a beautiful livery created by Sim UK. He's a, he's a fellow YouTuber uh, and he has done this um, for all us Welsh lovers and uh, and for me to be able to uh, drive my beloved Welsh rugby bus. What a fantastic thing, pro rugby. Look at that. Yes, I'm a big Welsh fan, and with the start of the Six Nations, it's uh, it's all good fun. We just had the first weekend. Wales got off to a good-ish start against Italy, um, and uh, yeah, but not probably as good as they should have. Not quite where they need to be. We've got England next week, and that's going to be a far tougher prospect indeed. England, of course, the reigning champions and the uh, probably the strongest home nation at the moment. Right, so let's just close up and we will get this baby fired up. Here we are. We're actually here in Mannheim and uh, we've got a little route. Let's just log in and I'll show you where we're going today. Uh, we're going to Karlsruhe. Karlsruhe? Yeah, I don't know. Apologies for butchering that, but that's where we're going today. Uh, so yes, a uh, big thank you to uh, Sim UK. Thank you ever so much for the uh, delivery. And by all means, go and check out his uh, his channel on YouTube. He does uh, he does bus sims. He do, he does all sorts of uh, simulation type uh, videos. So go and check him out. And thank you very much for the bus. Uh, right, let's just get this set up. Let's get the fanfare on, the Wi-Fi, kitchen on, the toilets, get the reading lamps on. We'll leave the announcements for the moment. Passenger monitor. Put the aircon on, let's stick up to 22 degrees, that tends to be where they like it. And um, destination display, driver's lights, heated mirrors, okay, windscreen heating on. Good, lovely, right. Put driving lights on and brake off. Let's just plunk her into gear. Oh, it's been a long time since I've driven this. So let's see how this goes. Yeah, just wanted to get back on the old buses, um, and there's always a traffic jam, isn't it? It's three o'clock, or coming up to ten to three. It's still a very wintry, snowy scene. Are you going to let the Welsh bus out? No, this is the Welsh bus, people. Thank you, Mr. Audi. Yeah, I encouraged him to uh, let me out by just driving out into the uh, into the road. This is a bit tight. I may probably jam up the road network. Oh, look at this. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now I've been in I've been in oh I love how the uh, the rear wheels turn, you can see that. Um it's a big old bus, that's for damn sure. Uh now obviously I have been to Cardiff many times to watch the uh, the rugby. And uh you do get sometimes get it. You get the uh the police horses coming down the road, clearing the way, and then you get this uh Coach following down. Wonderful sight. That's what he's waiting for then. Let's go. Right, let's try not to hit this low swinging branch from that tree. Yeah, we made that. Oh, yes. Having played Bus Simulator 16 recently, the... Uh, these buses handle so much differently. You can really feel the size on Fern Bus. You can really feel the size of those buses. We're going to get into this lane. The uh, the bus sim buses don't turn really sharply, and they're really quite easy to uh, to manoeuvre. These ones, they're a little bit more cumbersome, which is probably more true to life of what they should be. Come on, 
chugga chugga chug. Yes, so there has been an update for Phone Bus, and uh, one of the things that we noticed last time when we were stuck on the uh, 2016, they have updated the calendar, so that's a thing. We can now set dates in 2017, which is lovely. I thought that was Bonkers Casino there, it's Brokers Casino. I think Bonkers would have been better. Right, so we just got the uh, stop around here somewhere. Here we go, we got another fixed bus on the other side, lovely. Look at all these people jostling for position to be first on. Don't step out, sir! Sir! Get, get back on the pavement! Oh. Just gently nudge him off the road. Yeah, there we go. Honestly, some people, eh? You have to deal with all sorts in this line of business. Right, let's sort these um, delinquents out then. Sir, what? Sorry, my love, would you mind getting your breast out of the way? I'm trying to talk to this young delinquent. Sir, you cannot do that. Excuse me, love. Oh, right, fine. Well, if you'd get out of the way and let me open the door, you could put your luggage in there. What's wrong with these people? That guy wants a ticket, anyway. Hello, my love. We'll start with you. Do you have a ticket? Jachaval. Thank you very much. Where do you want to go? You want to go to Karlsruhe. Well, we're going there, although I probably have pronounced it badly. Uh, let's check if we've got any availability, sir. Yes, we do. You're on. You're welcome. Hello. On your pop. On your pop. If you're... Uh, Hello. Hello, thank you for your ticket. Uh, thank you. Hello, guten Tag. Order. You want to go there as well? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. There he is. Check. I thought he was giving me the finger then, but he wasn't. So I put, put, a, put your coat on, man. All these muscle Marys coming out in the... Uh, in the depths of winter with just these muscle shirts Hello. on. I mean, what's the matter with them? Keep warm. So many bugs and illnesses going around here at the moment. Of course you can. Love, who's jammed, seems to be jammed on the bus. There we go. Now, sir, all that hustle and bustle, I've left you to last purposely. I'll even close that and try and trap your hand in there. Yes. Yes. Get on. I don't want to hear from you again. He's just zoned in. Oh, have I managed to block the entire road network? You can get past. Don't be such a... There's plenty of room. Oh, look at that. Magnificent. Absolutely magnificent. There's my Flix bus. There's people on there. Hello. We got a few minutes, so can we get? Oh, we can't get on there. He's probably just popped to the uh, to the garage to get himself a pasty or something. Oh, don't blame him actually. All right, hello everyone. Let me just hop on. Uh, we'll get the doors closed. Keep the temperature in. Yeah, the, the other door went as well. I couldn't hear it at the time. Let's get old um, announcement chap going. Uh, we're due to depart here at two minutes past three. It is currently, well, we've got just under eight minutes. So let's just fast forward at a tiny bit. There we go. We've got a minute to wait now. That's much better. So we'll get the announcement going. Um, make sure everything's okay. Oh, we're going to look. We've got a, a little turning round circle up here, which is going to be good fun. And then we're heading back out of Mannheim. Pretty much the way we came by the sphere, which should be good. Some, uh, those neon blue lights are really quite bright, aren't they? Uh, that's on, that's good. The old notification thing. Right, uh, fortunately the traffic's too scared to go past. It's probably the fearsome Welsh dragon on the side. Who can blame them? They obviously know their rightful place on the road that, you know, oof, it's the Welsh bus. We know our place. We all defer to the Welsh bus, absolutely. 
Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach Let's go unsere this App. One minute before we can set off. There we go. Boom. Let's start the ride. Good stuff. Right. Handbrake off. Let's go. And we've just missed the light. However, Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt, nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. There's nothing over there, it's just a round, it's just a, a loop, so I'm not sure what we're waiting for, to be honest with you. Hello and welcome to Flixbus. We're glad to have you we'll do the dutiful thing though and wait. Looks like another crisp, chilly day here in Germany. Lots of snow. It's been quite, it's been quite mild in the UK in the last week or so. Yeah, it's definitely, um, it's definitely improved. You will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There's a restroom snacks and beverages. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge. Simply oh, they've, that, they've decided to go the opposite way to us. Have I gone the wrong way or have they gone the wrong way? Who knows? Probably neither. Although I do seem to be going against the flow of traffic here. Right, that red car was behind us, so who... Oh, we got it right. Yes! Where are you going? Where, it's my green light! What is he doing, honestly? Jump in the lights just because he... Lost the race. He chose the wrong direction. Which one was going to be the quickest route? Uh. All those other people on the bus are going. Hang on. How come he's going? We be, we were here first. Now we're still waiting. Yeah. We can finally set off. Well, we have set off, but we haven't actually gone far from the uh, the station. Or the bus stop. Was it? I don't know if it was actually a full-on bus station or just a stop. Ugh. This is a big old coach. This is the man's uh, C coach, which is a big old thing compared to the other one, and massive, massive compared to the uh, the bus sim 16 ones. But yes, we managed to get the uh, Mercedes. Sitaro buses on bus sim 16 for real Z's this time, uh, which was real good. I uh, checked them out last time. Yeah, pretty nice. They were um, a lot more developed than the placeholder bus that we uh, we saw in the uh, the preview branch of uh, performance patch, uh, which we managed to get a sneak peek of the Mercedes. Yes, yeah, a lot better product than what I drove at that point in time. Oh, hello. <laughs> Dong. Ah, oh, it's chiming for 16 minutes past three. Where's the, uh, is that the church over there? Yeah, there's the church. So obviously it's very, it's traditional in Germany for the bells to strike at 16 minutes past three. Um, in honour of the, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I was going to say something, but I'll probably just start offending somebody. So I'm just going to stop there. Even if you do a joke, people get offended. So, yes, yes. Apologies, this video is not gone out on the Monday. Um, that's mainly due to illness recently. Yes, I've I've had a touch of the old man flu. Uh, I've I've moaned on about it in the previous couple of videos, but um, it got to the point where I couldn't really. Uh, talk for any length of time before coughing and choking. I had a sore throat and that kind of thing. I'm doing five kilometers over the speed limit. Get a grip, people. Get a grip. Um, so unfortunately, you know, if you can't go five minutes without coughing and spluttering and um, choking to death, the highway maintenance really need to come out and trim these bushes, don't they? Um, that you really can't do anything recording-wise. So um, fortunately, couple more days to recover I thought that bus was that van was gonna understeer straight into the police car a couple more days to recover and I'm feeling a lot better and uh, we are all good to go yeah we had a bit of a drama last week unfortunately my uh, my girlfriend's daughter um, she will she we've all had this this flu 
type illness and uh, unfortunately she, hers progressed into uh, pneumonia last week so it, it was a trip to the hospital and um, you know people in hospitals they're absolutely fantastic and stuff are absolutely fantastic but yeah the triage bit took longer than we would have liked you know for a nine-year-old little girl who can't breathe um, it, it to my mind it took far too long to have that initial triage response um, so we've had a little bit of a moan but once we once you know once she was uh, looked at the staff were absolutely superb absolutely superb she's back out um, from hospital now she's back home she's uh, on antibiotics uh, every four hours or five hours whatever it is her mum's dealing with that <laughs> I'm not to be trusted with you know important things um, so yeah that was a bit of a worry last week as well so um, it's all kind of it's been quite a stressful busy week and uh, and not being very well as well it doesn't help with the old mood of uh, the situation so I apologize for not being able to get that video out but yeah it was a it wasn't the best of weeks not being well and other stress coming in But everything's back on track now, so hopefully uh, things will be good. Did he just kick snow over us? Was that just the sun reflecting? That's pretty awesome. Look at the landscape up front with the misty... The misty pine trees on the mountain over there. That's gorgeous, and the, uh, the power cables going through the mist. That's lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. Every so often, this game, the visuals will just... Just take your breath away. Just for, just for that moment, you forget that um, how beautiful some of the little effects they have on here. We then turn the corner and we've got this whopping great cooling towers of uh, some sort of power station or oil refinery. No doubt, 70 years ago in B17, I'd be trying to bomb them. <laughs> Here we are now, just driving through the beautiful countryside. Lovely. Oh, is that a... It actually looks like a... Hang on, wait till this truck goes past. So there's a combine over there. Can you see it? On the on the snow-covered moor, there is a little isolated combine. Hang on. What are you doing over there, Mr. Combine? You're out in the wrong... You know, you should be hibernating in the, in a barn somewhere. You know, we all, you know, it's like a tortoise. Combines are like tortoises. You should put them in a box with uh, loads of newspaper for the winter, you know, they shouldn't be out. Although I do remember the Top Gear guys converting a combine into a snow plough and gritting machine, which is quite amusing. With a flamethrower and everything. You know, it is Jeremy Clarkson, so yeah, he had to have a flamethrower or something stupidly ludicrous. Um, yeah, that was pretty cool, actually. Oh, we got a little bus, a little bus, a little bridge. Going over the river. Look at this. I'm very conscious when I look around not to drive straight into something. Well, this is nice. Nice bit of country driving for a change. It's nice to get out of the big cities, isn't it? Oh, we've got cars slowing down here. Going to go straight over. Lights are green. They're going to go amber, but, you know, if you've got your foot flat to the floor, when it's amber, you should be okay. That's always my philosophy. It actually looks like... I think I said a, a beautiful morning, misty morning, but it's actually coming to 4 o'clock, so... Um, misty evening. Yes. Should be getting dark about now, shouldn't it? Oh no, I suppose we've got another hour and a half of light. I'm thinking of GMT, so obviously Germany are an hour ahead of us, so this would be effectively 250 uh, GMT. So yeah, yeah, okay, so we've got a few more hours of light this time of year. This should be nice. The evenings are starting to draw out, which is lovely. There's nothing worse than, well, I was going to say, nothing worse than going to work and coming home in the dark, is there? Uh, and I realise working from home, that, that can be... Um, Sounds a little bit funny, but uh, I do go into the office every now and then. 
Oh, we're here already. Wow, that took next to no time. I thought this was going to be like a 35 minute trip. Oop. But it's uh, it's taking us like 15, 20 minutes. Wow, okay, well, this is going to be a lot quicker than I expected. I'm speeding. Oh, again, six kilometers. Should we, should we go around this? No, we won't. We won't go around this car. We'll, we'll play fair. We've got plenty of time. And we got the Rosses up front, so... Uh... There you go, Mr. I think that's supposed to be a Volvo. Of some sort. Creeping up slowly. The light's been green for some time. Go, go! Right, lovely stuff. Couple of turns, and then we'll be coming into the uh, stop. Uh, what time? Hang on, let's go around this corner, and then I'll have a quick look at the arrival time. Is for oh, we're on time. Well, pretty much about a minute or so behind, but nothing too bad. Uh, I noticed with the latest update. There's been some, you know content added in their uh, routes and stuff and then castle has been added as well the town which is pretty awesome uh, and of course you, you now get news updates so it tell you that you can now go to castle but there's also things like yes there's also lots of construction work on the is it the a38 I think it was I can't remember it's been a few minutes since I looked at that and um, YOLO YOLO did he just shout get off my bus <laughs> What are you saying about my driving? YOLO, honestly, you cheeky lighter. Off your pop, look, he's down to his knees. Somebody's obviously kneecapped him for his irritation earlier. There we go. Fantastic. Good job, everyone. Good job. Welcome to Karlshul. Karlshul? However you pronounce it. Uh, we better just confirm we are here and log out. We were a few minutes late, but nothing, nothing terribly bad. So here we go. Um, 14 of 14 passengers transported plus 10 tickets sold 2 of 2 plus 10 check in sold invalid tickets 0 0 stops completed 2 of 2 plus 10 contact with central 1 of 1 plus 10 refueling not required plus 5 R not ran not out of fueling yes plus 5 kilometers driven 75 uh, scheduled arrival 2 of 2 plus 10 scheduled departure 1 of 1 plus 10 plus on schedule no okay we'll probably be late then resting quality we didn't need to rest because it was a short trip missing passengers 0 0 restroom clearance 100 percent plus 10 reading light clearance uh, wireless clearance and passenger co uh, compartment lighting all 100 percent plus 10 Air condition 86% plus 8. Obviously, 22 degrees was not quite the temperature they liked. Announcement played 1 of 1 plus 10. Traffic rules. Maintain driving time 100% plus 10. Maintain work time. Yes, plus 10. Properties damage 0 plus 5. Pedestrians injured 0 plus 5. Or we always took out one of our uh, passengers to begin with. Accident 0. Radar control 0 plus 5 to both. Driving behaviour. Driven on road, 93.2% of the time. I'm trying to remember when I did not drive on the road. Uh, braking misbehaviour, 0 plus 5. Steering misbehaviour, 0 plus 5. Curbstones hit, 0 plus 5. Speed limits maintained, 96% of the time, 0. And safety distance broken, 0 plus 5. Which gives us 330 XP, which goes to our total of 8,239. Excellent, and we have unlocked this city. There we go, lovely. So we've got um, Saarbrücken here, which we need to unlock. We've got Hellebron or Hilbron, uh, Stuttgart, Freib Friedelberg, uh, Konstanz. <laughs> oh, everyone's just going to stop mispronouncing, mispron mispronouncing these cities. Wur Wurzburg, <laughs> uh, Nuremberg. Uh, Regensburg, uh, Augsburg, and München. München. Munich. Um, we also got up here. We've got uh, Paderborn, 
Never heard of that. Castle, which is, I think, the new one. So I think this is probably, or this one is the A38 or something. Erfurt, we've got Halle, uh, Leipzig, Dresden. Um, and up here we've got Kiel, Rostock and Selin, uh, Schroen and Hamburg. Well, we might as well get all the bad pronunciations out in one go, hey. So uh, you can uh, stop cringing now, German-speaking people. I apologise, but we are sorted. Right, so we, we we can go up north, but we might as well do a bit of driving around here, clear up all these cities. So maybe next time, maybe we could do a two-stopper next time. I'm thinking maybe we'll go to Hilbron and to Stuttgart. Yeah. Yeah, so if that's 20 minutes, that'll probably be about 40 minutes, won't it? So it'll be not bad. It'll be lengthy, but not too bad an episode. So that's something we can potentially look at next time. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. Short but sweet. Um, yes. Again, Once again, sorry about the uh, delays in the videos and stuff, but uh, it couldn't be helped. Um, I'm sure uh, you understand and everything. So, yep. Uh, I will see you next time for more bus action. We'll probably do a Bus Sim 16 next time. Uh, so in two weeks, we'll have another Fern bus. So until then, I'll see you later.